Carlos Marín, the baritone member of International Pop Opera Fusion Vocal Quartet Il Divo, has died, his bandmates announced. He was 53. It is with heavy hearts that we are letting you know that our friend and partner, Carlos Marín, has passed away, remaining group members David Miller, Sebastián Zambert and Ursula Buller announced Sunday on social media. He will be missed by his friends, family and fans. There why you'll never be another voice or spirit like Carlos. For 17 years the four of us have been on this incredible journey of Il Divo together, and we will miss our dear friend, we hope and pray that his beautiful soul will rest in peace. The official Il Divo Twitter account announced December 10 that remaining shows for the month had been rescheduled due to illness and shared Thursday that Marine had been admitted to the hospital though a cause was not disclosed in either a. USA Today has reached out to the group's representatives for more information. Il Divo, the pop fusion group built by music producer and singing competition judge Simon Cowell in 2004, was comprised of U. S. Born Miller, Buhler from Switzerland, Isambard of France, and Marine, who was born in Germany but raised in Spain. The concept was essentially a boy band for pop opera fanatics, with photogenic members sporting beautifully crafted suits and singing melodramatic songs that tug at the hard strings, except for Azambird, the members were classically trained. The formula made them wildly successful around the globe, with platinum albums, major tours and, in the United States, PBS specials. But the group has never achieved the critical respect it deserves, is Amber told the Arizona Republic, part of the USA Today network. Our success is due to our audience, he said in 2014. Radio doesn't know where to play us. We're not a cool band. We don't sing like Miley Cyrus. I don't think people give us credit because of how we got together. Miller likened Cowell's creation of the group to an arranged marriage in a 2018 interview with the Associated Press. They hadn't worked together before, but sang a few songs together and realized they were building our own musical universe. It was really hard to get along in the beginning, is Amber told the Arizona Republic.